Edinburgh Dundee stars tonight at Brayhead Arena. They won 4-3 in overtime. As you can see, joining me to give the Dundee point of view is the player coach, Jeff Hutchins. Jeff, two wins over two nights. How happy are you right now? Good. I mean, you know, uh, going into Belfast, anytime you go into Belfast, it's a long travel day. And, uh, you know, we hung around, we hung around, and then, you know, our, we, we capitalized on some... Uh, some mistakes that they made in the third and you know we, we got up 4-2 and we just uh, we were determined we were going to close it out last night and you know and that's a f it's a big thing for our club uh, it's the first time we've won over in Belfast uh, and it's the first time they've beaten Belfast so it, it, it's, it's a great thing for our club and, and it's good for us to move forward. And by two points in the conference as well you're chasing down Brayhead for that extra point as well tonight. Well I mean you know I, I, I didn't think we played our best game I thought they came out uh, you know, and played really hard, and, and you know we were fortunate we got some bounces. But uh, you know, earlier in the season we weren't getting those bounces, and um, you know they seem to be in this last spell of four games. They seem to have been going our way. So you know we'll ride it as long as we can and uh, try to correct the mistakes that we made. And um, you know we we focus on on playing Edinburgh tomorrow. Now Sammy Ryan and Mike Merrill doing it again for you. <coughs> Why are they so good together? Well, I mean, to be honest, uh, you know that they've they've raised their game um, not only offensively, that they've raised their game defensively in the last four games, and I think it's made a big difference. Um, you know, we're turning over less pucks, and and you know, um, you know, we're not exposing our D and our goalie to uh, you know so many three on twos and, and, and odd man rushes. And um, you know, I can be any more prouder than those guys. I think you know, I've had you know, I sat them down and had a little word with them, you know, about four games ago, and you know, said that it's great to get an offense. Um, but you know, if, if you're giving up more goals than you're, than you're creating, then you know that's where we have a problem. And they've taken that on board, and uh, you know they've been fantastic. They were probably, you know, I mean, they had four points out of five last night, and uh, you know, um, it's it was from offensive uh, turnovers. Uh, they, they, they've turned the puck over in the last four games and created offense off it, and it's it's worked. So now you've got Edinburgh tomorrow, as you mentioned. They got a, they got a penalty shots one down in Hull tonight. Edinburgh have have. Had a, a good run of form, I think, December. Tonight oh, was their first one of 2013. How yeah. difficult a game is that going to be for your guys? Well, I think it's always a tough, tough game against them. They play, you know, a very, um, you know, sit back and wait uh, game, and, and they capitalize. And, and you know, they, I always tell my guys they cheat better than us. So if we're going to try to cheat, we're going to lose the game. And um, you know, the last time we played them in Dundee, we just sat back and, and let them come to us. And you know, and uh, we clogged up the middle, and, and their, their top guys had a tough time penetrating the zone. And, you know, we. You know, we won the game two nothing with a, with an empty net goal. But um, you know, I'll take I'll take all of those for the rest of the year. Now, two ends out of two. It's a three game weekend. Does the fact that you've won the two games give you a huge boost going into tomorrow's game? Does that not make you seem as tired? If you know what I mean, not as um, not as um, fatigued. No, I think uh, you know. Obviously, we, we cut down to two lines tonight, and uh, you know we're going to be really uh, um, going in tomorrow's game with the intention of using three lines. I think uh, you know um, they gonna, they're going to start out with three lines, and, and we're going to need to depend on our younger guys to to come through. And you know they're improving every day, and uh, you know they're making me more confident every day that, that I can put them in situations, and, and they won't you know won't uh, let the team down. And uh, you know we're going to count on them tomorrow, and. Uh, the guys, uh, they got to go into it thinking that we're going to win the game, and, and it's a big two points for us. Good stuff. Well, thanks for joining us, Jeff. Good no luck problem. tomorrow, and thank you.